Well, hello again. Welcome back to another video. It's gonna be a follow-up video for my YouTube Notion dashboard video. I talked in that video how I'm running, how I have like social media automations through Notion. So in this video, I'm gonna show those automations. I'm using three different services to make it happen. Notion, uh, make.com and Buffer. So let's go through the whole flow, how it works, and maybe you get some ideas how to run your own social media easier. So so yeah, we're in, in Notion right now. This is pretty much the dashboard I showed in the video. You can find the video link somewhere. If you want to see that, check it out. Uh, but yeah, here we're going to go. This one is going to be mainly about the social media. So first, you're going to be creating your social media post here. You can open it up, write a random title, random social media post. You can put some tags just to kind of keep track on what you're posting. So I usually do gaming. Then you get to pick the platforms. That it's gonna be posted so right now mine works with instagram uh, facebook twitter and mastodon those are like automated i'm waiting for api for threads and then i can use that too you could do tiktok and shorts also if you paid for notion because the, then you can put a bigger size on the on your thingies right now i'm limited at five megabits so i can really only do pictures but I might try, I might pay for Notion and try that out and have full on, full on social media automation here. But yeah, you pick the platforms. Then here you can put the picture uh, that you want to post. And then you write here on the final post, you write your thingy, whatever you want to post. And you get to pick what time it posts. And that's pretty much it. And then we're going to go to the make.com, which does pretty much the automation. So it puts my post from Notion into Buffer. So here's the whole diagram for make.com. Basically, every two hours, it runs and checks if there is any new new posts in Notion. Then it just goes through this whole thing and it will automatically send it to these. It will send it to Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and Mastodon right now. So this is fairly simple. There's not much to, to this. I could create a more in-depth guide if someone is interested. So tell me in the comments and I will... I can go step by step how to do this, but these are basically just buffer that you're connecting to your Facebook and it will have a link from the Notion. It will have a date and the text. So this, this portion is fairly simple. And now we get to the final part, which is the buffer. So the, the make.com basically puts buffer is what you use for scheduling your posts. So right now I have three different channels here. I have my Instagram, I have my X and I have a Mastodon. So it will automatically schedule posts here based on the schedule you picked in Notion. As a free account, you get to pick three different ones and then you have to pay. If you want to put more uh, social medias, you have to pay for it. But three has been good enough for me for now. I will probably have to pay after uh, threats comes and then I can basically do that. But yeah, but yeah, that's pretty much quickly explained how it works. So we can actually run one uh, manually so I can show you uh, it in action. So let's just pick we're gonna post on Twitter and Mastodon here. We're gonna do a final post and we're gonna hello world. I can put an image here. I'm just gonna put random thumbnail that I have made here. And that's pretty much it. Oh yeah, we have to put the schedule. So let's put it up for tomorrow and yeah, 12 a.m. is good. Let's pick that one. Let's go for uh, 15. Let's pick three o'clock. So it will be tomorrow at three o'clock. It will post hello world based inside Notion. Then I can manually run in, in make.com. So we're gonna run once. It will run it one time. You can see it picked up the uh, the post from Notion, and then it just goes to each platform. And once it gets end of the here, it will actually tag the uh, the post in Notion and put it in that it's already posted. So that that's automatically checked. You can check if it if it's working proper. And then in Buffer we have a hello world with the picture, and now it will be automatically posted. Uh, tomorrow three o'clock so it's a very easy way to post on multiple flat platforms and you don't have to do much they actually give you a pretty nice amount of operations on on make.com so you get thousand operations as a free user i've been able to use around six seven hundred per month but if you're like a power user uh you gotta go through this quite quickly and then you have to pay so i think thousand is for free is quite fair and if you use this more than that then you probably should pay anyway like it's so useful in that regard and there's a lot of other things you could do with like google drive and stuff like that so it there's a lot of use cases especially for social media stuff i've seen people do like automated stuff in where it, it goes through like chat gpt and then automatically posts on link linkedin and stuff like that so you could definitely do crazy stuff but yeah that's pretty much how i get my social media posts from notion into all my platforms 
it makes it very uh, easy to organize like sometimes you can post a full week worth of stuff and then you don't kind of have to think about it which is always great but yeah tell me in the comments uh, if you have any other auto automations you do for especially content creation i'm really curious to hear what kind of stuff people have done and give this video a like if you find it helpful subscribe to my channel thanks for watching i hope you have a good one take care bye bye